Your MyTMCC Student Center includes several tools designed to help you stay on track with your educational goals. Let's review what's known as your Academic Advisement Report, often referred to as either your Advisement Report or your AAR. An Advisement Report is based on a student's officially declared degree goal. It shows you what classes are required for the degree and shows how your completed and in-progress courses count towards your degree. From your Student Center, Use the first drop-down menu to select Academic Requirements, then click the double arrow button. At the top of the page, ensure you have selected TMCC as the institution. It is important that you click Expand All to ensure you may see all of your completed and in-progress courses. The current Academic Objective box lists your current declared degree on file. In this case, we can see that the student is pursuing an Associate of Science transfer degree. The current Academic Summary box lists your current TMCC GPA. Most AARs start with General Education and then move into the Emphasis requirement. As we can see, this student has satisfied their three-credit diversity requirement by completing HDFS 232 in Fall 2019. In the next section, though, we can see that the student has not yet completed the U.S. and Nevada Constitution requirement. Many degrees will give you a few options for this requirement. For example, a student may take Core Humanities 203, History 111, or Political Science 101 to cover both the U.S. and the Nevada Constitution requirement using a single course. However, you may also take History 101 to cover the U.S. Constitution and then take a separate course, such as History 102, History 217, Political Science 100, or Political Science 208 to cover the Nevada Constitution requirement. Students will choose either Option 1, taking one course, or Option 2, taking two courses. Either way will satisfy the requirements. The report then continues to go through the general education requirements. Remember when I asked you to click the Expand All button? Well, here's why. This student is currently taking English 114. While the student has not yet passed the class, the report lists this course as being satisfied. So you always want to see where your in-progress courses are plugging into a report. Next is math, which has not yet been satisfied. An Associate of Science requires a minimum of Math 126, but other degrees will have different requirements, so it's important to review your AAR very carefully. Let's take a look at Humanities. The report will always show the first 10 class options available, but there are over 40 classes that may satisfy the Humanities requirement. You may click View All to review all of your options. Not sure which class to choose? Click on a class name to review the course description and see if the class has a prerequisite. For example, English 232 has a prerequisite of English 101 or equivalent. Since this student is currently in English 114, the student has met the prerequisite. Click Return to My Academic Requirements to continue viewing the report. Students pursuing some type of Associate of Arts degree or Associate of Science degree will be required to complete six credits of general education science, including one credit or unit of lab. Students pursuing an Associate of Applied Science degree are only required to complete three credits of science. Again, review the course descriptions and prerequisites carefully. After the general education requirements, AARs move into the emphasis requirements. The emphasis in an Associate of Science transfer degree is made up of university transferable electives, whereas a degree such as business would list very specific required courses. Remember to click View All or View Course List to see all available options. The remainder of the report outlines general degree requirements. All certificates are a minimum of 30 credits. 
All associate's degrees are a minimum of 60 credits, and bachelor's degrees are a minimum of 120 credits. However, it must be credits from required courses as outlined previously in the AAR. Transfer students must have met TMCC's transfer residency requirements by completing at least 15 credits at TMCC. And finally, students must have a minimum 2.0 grade point average in order to qualify for graduation. Again, your advisement report is based on your declared degree on file. If you are considering changing your degree or pursuing an allied health program, such as nursing or dental hygiene, be sure to run a what-if report, which is covered in another video. If you have more questions, you may schedule an appointment with an academic advisor online at myadvisor.tmcc.edu.